YouTube. So today we're going to be unboxing the DJI 03 air unit. Um, we're going to be addressing the wobbles that people seem to be having, including myself. Um, it seems like after a few crashes, it uh, starts to knock the lens loose. And they didn't put any type of glue or reinforcement to stop that from happening. So today, I'm going to show you what we're going to do to fix that. This is it. We're going to be diving into the camera itself. So we'll start off taking out these bolts right here. Start with that. There we go. Pull the housing off. That's what we got on the inside. So our next step is going to be there's four, four littler screws right here, here, and also here and here. We'll be taking those off. Last one. That should be it. And just pull the housing off. Slips right off. Sometimes they're you gotta play with it. That one actually came off pretty smooth, so that was cool. So what we're gonna be doing is if you have a brand new one and you just want to prevent it, you're just gonna go ahead and put what I like to use is the the glue that we would get in like elementary school. Put a dab of it over here and a dab of it over here. I just kind of work its way around the, the rim where the thread is. So if you're already having the problem where it's shaking, you're going to have to go ahead and adjust. Because you're going to have play when you go like that. It's going to shake a little bit. You're going to have to adjust that, your focus using your goggles, twist it, check it, twist it, check it. Once you find it where you need it to be, you're going to go ahead and do the same thing. I like to use a toothpick, get in there, move it around. Um, let me go grab the glue. So the glue I like to use is Elmer's glue. Pretty basic. You can get it anywhere you need to, like Walmart, basic hobby shops. Let's take a little dab. I'll try to get in there so you guys can see. I'm just going to go right in here and get it right up against where the threading is. I like to put a lot on there so I don't have to open it back up again. I mean, honestly, who likes doing that? Come on, DJI. Should be handling these things. So I suggest doing this if you get any O3 air unit brand new is the easiest way to do it because then you don't have to adjust the focus again. It should be already set. And if you didn't, then you just gotta adjust it. It takes a little extra time, but it's definitely worth it. Get rid of that jello. Shout out to Fly High FPV because he's the one that actually uh, told me about this. Without him, I wouldn't have even known how to fix it. So, shout out to Fly High FPV. That should be it. Always get off the stuff that gets on the lens, on the outer side of it. Looks good to me. 
go ahead take the housing and put that back on this is always the part that's a little tricky for me I always hate putting these little tiny screws back they're easy to take out not so easy to put back in So now we have the screws on, now we just have to put the back on. Make sure you don't pinch that little wire back there. Make sure it's in all the way. Once you have both of them screws in, you're all finished. Um, I would probably give it a few hours to dry before you go fly it. But your next step would be throwing it into a frame. And this is what I'm putting this in. Um, it's from Woodchuck FPV. It's a wasp frame. I got it at the Barbecue Bando event in Georgia. I'm pretty excited to put this together. Can't wait to rip it gonna put this to the test uh, I'll give you guys a review on it once I get some packs in on it and until next time